What's up, guys? Jamin here. Today we're back with another video, and the Edmonton Oilers have fired Peter Shirelli and have replaced him with an intern GM, Keith Gretzky. Now, Peter Shirelli should have been fired a while ago. He traded Taylor Hall for Adam Larson, Jordan Eberle for Ryan Strom, and then Ryan Strom was traded for Ryan Spooner, and Ryan Spooner was sent down. So yeah, they definitely lost both of those trades. Re-signed Miro Kaiskinen for three years. That I don't remember the contract, but he also did pretty bad trades on the Bruins. He traded Tyler Sagan for basically nothing. Well, the pick for Tyler Sagan. He traded Blake Wheeler for basically nothing. Peter Shirelli's just a very, very bad GM. And if he gets a job somewhere, I don't know why he would get a job. But if he ends up getting a job, I'll be very, very surprised. That's just my PlayStation remote going off. And Keith Gretzky, I believe he was an assistant GM at one point. So that, so that's good. Obviously, Wayne Gretzky's brother, so that would be good. But I like this move by the Oilers, of course, just firing Peter Shirley. But it should have happened a while ago, like I said. There's not good. Hopefully, there's no more bad trades for the Oilers, at least for the next year. I heard they are trying to get Matt Zuccarello and Ryan Dezingo for my auto centers, which would suck. But that means we could keep at Shane Mark, Mark Stone. I'm happy about it. The Oilers right now are not in the playoffs. They're on a three-game losing streak. They lost to Detroit last night. And if you lose to Detroit, you're not good at all. Just saying that. And just trading last year's league MVP for Adam Larson. And then Jordan Eberle for Ryan Str That just makes no sense. Comment down below what you think about this. My next video will probably be the Auto Sense Game Recap. Make sure you like and subscribe. Five subscribers away from 100. I am out. Peace.